What's going on, everybody? I'm M. King, and this Motivate Moment is called Patience. You know, we've all had to be patient with God. You know, His ways are not our ways, says the Bible. And you know, my patience with God has always been, well, working in the security industry. I do it full time, and well, it wasn't exactly something I fell into full time. It was something I had to make a choice to do full time. That's right. When I originally lost my job in corporate America, I had to figure out where to go, and there weren't a lot of options for me. Well, Lord and behold, I already had my guard card, so it kind of just made sense from the Lord's standpoint for me to go in security full time. You know what's interesting? I've been vocal about wanting to leave the security industry full time to run my own ministry named King Media. But isn't it funny how God had other things in mind? He knew there was going to be a pandemic, and he knew one of the essential jobs that I would need to be in would be security. It's funny, looking back at everything else, a lot of the jobs I could have gone into, God knew they weren't going to be essential. Isn't that interesting? How we have to let God have his way and have his timing with our dreams. You know, at the end of the day, I know God is going to one day allow me to go full time, but I have to be patient. And you know what that makes me think of? That makes me think of a poem that was actually written by uh, Loretta Burns. And the poem goes like this. As children bring their broken toys with tears for us to men, I brought my broken dreams to God because he was my friend. But then instead of leaving him in peace to work alone, I hung around and tried to help with ways that were my own. At last, I snatched them back and cried, how can you be so slow? My child, he said, what could I do? You never let go. How many of us out there are so guilty of just, not, you know, just not letting go? We need to let go and let God. So what I want to say to you is whatever you're dealing with right now, whatever you're going through, be thankful. God knows why you need to go through it, and God knows why you need to be in it, just like he knows why I need to be in security. See you next time.